Hello, I'm here at Longmill School today talking to Randeep about a project that's been running for many years at Longmill School that's had really positive outcomes for children and their families called the Deaf Adult at Home Project. Right, that's right, yes. Hello Randeep, thank you for speaking to me today. That's fine. Can you tell us a little bit about the project? So two deaf adults go in the home and we teach the family with resources, signs. So we want to encourage the parents for the benefit of the child and to show them how easy it is to communicate with their own child and the importance of it. So when they grow up, they can have role models. So if the family can have effective communication, then obviously it's beneficial for the child. And do you involve lots of the family in that? Parents, grandparents? Yes, that's right. Aunties, uncles, grandmother, grandfather, as much of the extended family as possible. Okay. How many weeks do you go into the home for? The project went for six weeks. So first, initially, we'll go in and one person will introduce, have a look, explain who we are. So we have an introduction. And then that person goes out and then the two deaf adults go in and we run the project for the six weeks. But we make sure that the child is also involved in the six week project. So the child also becomes involved and actually becomes like a teacher with us and helps teach their own family sign language. I bet the children really like that. Oh, they really enjoy it. I think it's important for the child as well because for the family, they see that the child can have facial expressions, their hand shape, you know, just to encourage the child to improve their own sign as well. So you'll introduce sign language within this six week period. What other <coughs> sorts of things will you do? When the six week project is finished, what we try to do is encourage the, the parents to go to the sign language class or to even get involved in a class that Longwood puts on to teach the parents and try and achieve their level one sign language or even their level two. And do lots of parents come along and join that? So first we initially do the six weeks, then at the end of the six weeks they go to BID or become part of Longwood's um, parents group. And they try and come every week to that, so that's all really good. They have access to that that's resource. Good. What sort of things do parents say to you after the six week course is finished about the course? So the feedback we get is usually very positive actually. The environment, the community, the deaf community that they didn't know existed and also just getting involved in local societies. So that's really, really good and positive for the parents and they try and go with their child and their extended family as well. So they can communicate, they can see other deaf adults, role models for the child, so that's all positive. Oh, that's really good. Could you tell me some more positive outcomes you've had from the project? So for example, the child's sign language is improved and that's really important for their development, obviously. And that's also positive. So also we get involved in outside clubs like NDCS, so they get involved in things like that that they didn't know existed or weren't, were not able to access before, which is also a great experience for all the children. Thank you. Thank you for telling us about that today, Randeep. No problem. It's my pleasure. Thank you.